Well, welcome back here, guys. Had a few hours of action already. Got the Sun Bears currently under a bit of pump from the Dakar Warriors. 36 for North in the fourth over. This one could go again. This is high. I think it's going to be six again, though. That's gone a long way. It's a pitching wedge. Straight up and go on the distance. So some bears just need to look to see if they can tighten up a little here. One or two wickets. We're going to look to their talismanic captain, Tertius, for a wicket. Oh, nice ball there from Zalik. So Dakar Warriors v Sun Bears. 42 for Norton out. One ball left in the fourth. Zalik just wants to get out this over. Oh, it's a wide though. He'll have to bowl that one again, I think. It looks like they're back underway and over at UKM. Cassaway is about to take on the Kiwi team, the Nengi Lees. Our scorer there just uh, having a momentary lapse in concentration. Oh, that's big. That's gone. That's out of here. Spare ball. Tertius. The spare ball going out here. And that was a big hit there from the left-hander. I think that's, is that Aman Abdullah Aman? Might be. I think it is the big hitter. No, Aman Ola Aman. He is 34 off 11. Five, just a casual five sixes. He's going with either a six or a one at the moment. So Tertius into bowl now. Nice strong action. He generally shapes it away from the right handers, but uh, probably won't swing this one much. It's copped a bit of damage. Just went for four of his first over. Oh, well bowled in the block hole. He'll have to do the work off his own bowling here, though. So some bears need a wicket here. Our man Zalek, he's going to provide the wicket. The left-handed Aman going to be weighing up this side of the ground here. Oh, and a nice delivery there from Tertius. Just getting it to leave the left-hander. Plenty of encouragement being yelled from Big Hendrick down there. So nice bowling there from Tertius. Just staying the ball up on the seam. A big hit there from him. And oh, just over the head of the fielder. So another six. Aman Ola, we said he only deals in dots, ones, or sixes. He's now hit six sixes in the 13 ball stay. It's good striking. Anything full, he just climbs into. So it remind, bats a little like uh, LMS's finest. Hasib Ahmed just climbs into anything full and dispatches it for six. Oh, oh, I think that's actually bounced off the cut strip. So that's going to be a no ball and a free hit. And that's not what the Sun Bears want. Aman will be thinking six. Oh, he was thinking six. Doesn't quite get it. So it's going to be his second favorite. That's a single.
And that's the end of the fifth over. So 61 for Nort after five here. Run rate 12.2. They need to try and get Sad Ibna to face as much of the strike as possible. So new over here, it's going to be Shazan on to bowl. So Shazan Shams, he's uh, from Dhaka and Bangladesh. So you know a bit about the Dhaka Warriors. Loose start there down the leg side. So I'm going to ask for a bit of input here from our man Asib. But what's Shazan's normal team in Dakar, Asib? Commonwealth CC. So if you're watching on from Dakar, your man from Commonwealth CC is out here. Aman Ola. Wait forward. Oh, that's big. You can't bowl full tosses to Aman Ola Aman. And that's his 50. Great knock there by Aman. Gets a, a hug and a clap. We'll uh, have to get a picture of him as he comes off. So we'll get someone to take a photo of Aman as he comes off to celebrate his 50. So what a knock that was. 17 baller, seven big sixes, strike rate of 300, 51 off 17. And he retires. And now it's going to be Akash out to bat, I believe. A Fizraman Akash. The great knock there by Aman Ula Aman. Seven sixes. <laughs> He's absolutely smashed it. So, well, we've got Saad Ibn at the other end. He's 16 or 13. Just a 1-4. That's another wide, so nice start there. So it's A B G Bon who went Akash did me day, told me he was batting three. It's uh it's A B and I wonder if he's gonna bat like our man A B. Look to go three sixty. Starts with a, we well go off the mark with a wide, which is always handy. And st next ball, just a knock into the leg side for one. And Saad Ibna, now back on strike. Shazan, oh, this could be out. Tush is going back, but it's over his head again. Oh, and the ball's gone down. The running out of spares here. We'll have to send someone to fetch all the spares again. Probably be me. So, a bit of pressure on here. Was it SEQ Cassaway's a 12th naught after two in their match against the Nengi Lees? At UKM. That one's just going to be a single. Good fielding out there. Oh, but he's missed it. They're going to come back for two. So an overthrow. Just took a little bobble off the Astro. The corner of the Astro. He's got other games going on in, uh, across the world at the moment. Joburg Saturday competition is getting underway. West Sydney Saturday division also underway. So it's great to see 
so many games. So 80 for Nort now after six. Again, it Usman Javid. Oh, down the leg side. Well done there by Chuverson. Nice there by. not convinced that is Usman Usman's at mid wicket but we'll swap it over later oh this one's chopped down will it be a quick single it comes through easily in the end Leg sides a little bit loose here. Again, loose. There's a few wides creeping in here. That's the end of the over. So, new bowler coming in now. So, this is Mo now to bowl. Yeah, bowls a little bit of leg spin, maybe. But we'll see. So, just our fielder out there. Sibs just fetched a few of the balls. They got launched into the lower level here. So a nice college here. They've got a rugby and football field down on one side. It's going to be a wide, so just a bit loose here. That's six wides in the last 11 deliveries. So a little bit loose here. From the Sun Bears, struggling with their discipline. Oh, short ball. And that's wide as well. I think it was for height and down the leg side potentially. Oh, and 
that wide again. So that's six wide deliveries in a row now for the Sun Bears. Unfortunately for them, they just need to get it straight here. And they've put it under put under a lot of pressure here. Armin Ularoman got them off to a flyer. 51 off 17. That's better. It's almost an off pace ball. It's chunked out to long off for one. So good here from the Sun Bears. Just need to keep it tight here. Keep going stump to stump. That last delivery from Osman was solid. So two balls left in this over. Going round the wicket now to the left-hander. AB. Oh, that's going to be a no ball. So a, a beamer. And the 100 up. Oh, and they're coming back for two. So five off that delivery. And it's going to be a free hit as well. So not the greatest start here for Uzi. Free hit. Slow ball straight up. Is it going to go for six? And it does. So six off the free hit. And the batsman, AB Jibon, call. He's just hit a six and he's calling for a new bat. <laughs> he's just plonked the six over mid wicket and he's calling for a new bat. So he's obviously not happy with that one. Shudder to think how far they're going to go next time he hits one out the middle. So pressure on the Sun Bears here. Looks like it's going to be the skipper Tertius taking the responsibility on. Might see some uh, leg spin from Usman next over maybe. So Tertius. <clears throat> the bowl. Quite a straight set field, so he's going to look to bowl full and straight here, I think. There's no one behind to go on either side of the wicket, really. Oh, when he goes short, he's outfoxed all of us here. No one behind square, and he goes into the wicket short, but he gets away with it, gets the dot ball. I think it's he's going to aim to go stump to stump and fuller. He has to with this field. No one behind square. This is length and it's flipped away out to that man at deep square leg. Just for one. So a good start here from Tertius. Just turning the screws a little. Need to, need a wicket here. Dakar Warriors got off to a flyer. Armin Ularaman, 51 off 17. Seven big sixes. That's good bowling that. Nice shot though on the up. Beats the fielder. What a shot that was. Looked like a good delivery. Length on off stump. But uh, AB jib on. Weight through the ball. Climbed into it. Hit on the top of the bounce. Do extra cover. One sixteen for Nort in the ninth over. This one's worked. Looking for two. Smart batting. Not sure if he's going to get back. I oh, will. He will. Difficult to judge the distance there, but uh, it's a good effort out there. Just keeping that man 10 meters off the boundary now. Again. Oh, nice work by Tertius. Oh, and it would have been a great bit of fielding. Captain leading by example out there. So the end of the ninth over, 118 for Nort.
looks like it's going to be Hendrick to bowl. So we've got Hendrick coming into the attack. So, six bowler here for the Sun Bears. Hendrick, he'd be looking to get a breakthrough. Don't know what he bowls. Maybe a bit of spin. Yeah. Oh, maybe just going over the top. It looked pretty. It looked good for Hart from side one. So, Hendrick thought it was pretty good. Usman, what did you think? There's a thick outside edge running away towards the third man boundary. Tertius after it. Just keeps it inside. Well done. And back for two. Was Hendrick just moving Usman a bit squarer. So Hendrick, good st tidy start from him here. Oh, well that could be a wide, and it's gone through. Chuvy the keeper. It's going to be two buys as well. Oh, just a, just a bit of a same old story for the Sun Bears here. Unfortunately, just a few loose deliveries, a few wides, no balls. I think every bowl has been a little bit culpable. <clears throat> so Dakar Warriors. Looking to set a big score here. We'll try and get a, a word from the the leader here. Shani, and what's you thinking? 250? Aiming for 250? Yeah, right. So I just said there, they've got uh, one man in the hut already, two approaching their 50, so... Free license for the rest of the lineup now. Oh, that's another wide. So just again, just untidy here. Hendrick started the over nicely. Oh, big swing there by Saad Ibna. He's trying to hit that 400 meters, I think. Off the first tee, but no connection. So end of the tenth over. Swap round now. One two six for naught. So ten overs done here in this third match. So Malaysia Open here at KTJ. If we check some scores from other parts of the world. So SEQ Casaro 66 for naught after 6.2. And over at UKM, we've got uh SEQ Cassowaries motoring along 67 for naught now after 6.3. <coughs> James Kane 39 off 23. Jeremy Kempson 24 off 12. So I think they may be playing a, a 10 over game over there. Because they were off for rain for quite a while. We were lucky here. Just a couple of passing showers. And then we managed to get back on. So I'll waste the new bowler here. For the Sun Bears. I'll waste Siddiqui. He needs a wicket. Oh, the leggy. Quick leg spin. Rashid Khan-like.
As and quite quickly to the head of leg spinner. Oh, short, but drag down. That's Wallop. That's going to be a six. That onto the road. New ball, please. That one's been tonked onto the grass verge by the motorway here. So great hit. As uh, Sad Ipna moves on to 48 here. Needs to go into a bag of spare balls here. I think we could see some fireworks in this back half. Short ball again. Slapped. Fielder. Oh, he missed it. Oh, no. He got a hand on it. Managed to half stop it. Well done. So just the one. So a single to Saad. He moves on to 49. But nice fielding down there. Well done. Got one ball left in this over. No, that's a nice delivery. Very nice leg spinner there from always. Good speed through the air. A little bit of dip. At the end of the over. So just a nine off it. Now we're going to see Big Hendrick to bowl his second. So one three five for Nort here. Saad Ibner on strike. So sorry, it's Hen it won't be Saad on strike. It's a lefty jib on. But Hendrik Kruger to bowl again. The off spinner. This one's whacked straight. I think it's going to go for four. And it does. So Jibon hit that straight back down the wicket. Keeps the pace on the ball. And just trickle it over the rope and long off. A great shot. So Kruger again. That's better up in the block hole and does well off his own bowling. Keeps it to a dot. It's lovely and warm here in Kuala Lumpur today. It feels like temperature is probably about 40, I reckon. Oh, Hendrik, the big man got up but couldn't quite get up high enough. Chance to run out to the balls in, but no. He just took too much pace off that. I think he fingertipped it and just meant they could come back for two. Big hit out to the deep here. It's going, going back. And four runs. <laughs> the umpire's looking the wrong way there to find the scorer. So one, four, five for Nord here. Last ball of 12th over. Dakar Warriors. They're putting on a show. World Championship finalists. They've brought a strong side here to the Malaysia Open. Oh, this one's out. Could be caught. Tersh is coming. Oh, he puts it down. It's unfortunate. He got there just, but just couldn't cling on. He was sliding forward. So Jibon. Moves on to 45 off 19. Great knock from him. And that's the end of another over. Eight left here. And looks like it's going to be... I think this is Mo Ahmed bowling. I think it's Mohammed Ahmed bowling. So... Slightly expensive in his first over. Mm. 
Nice shot there by Jibon. And nice footwork down there by away Siddiqui. Keeps it to two. A little coy turn trapped it inside with the right boot. This is hit straight again. Trace a bullet off the tee. If this was golf, they'd call that the stinger. A three wood down the fairway. A couple of bounces and into the side screen for four. So great knock there by Jib on 51 off 21 deliveries. Four fours and one six. So new batsman strides to the crease, just getting a round of applause was Jibon from the, the crowd. So Maruf Ahmed into bat now. I think he's got absolute license here to just hit as hard as he wants. Averages 44 with the bat in 75 LMS games. Strike rate of 158. Handy bowler as well by the looks of things. 84 wickets in his 75 matches. Not bad. Good strike rate. Second ranked bowler in Bangladesh and 18th ranked batsman. So just relentless here from the Warriors, the Sun Bears up against it. So the good ball there from Mo. Got ball to start for Maruf as he just has a look. Runs nicely flick off the hip for a single. Hendrick tidies up out there. Shot. That's a cracking shot to extra cover that. I think it's going to go for four and it does. Great hit there by Saad Ibna. And he's retired as well now. So two new batsmen at the crease. So Saad Ibna goes to 53. Of 32 deliveries. The slowest 50 of the lot, but he looked very composed. Looked a good batsman. The new batsman now it is Akash. Araf is a man, Akash. Played for a few teams in Bangladesh, but uh, here today with Dakar Warriors. And he does know how to hit at 360. You probably see a few funky shots from him. And hit it to all parts. That's big, going back, back. Just hits, stays inside the fence out there, thankfully. So big hit by Maruf Ahmed. He goes to seven off three. He's gone dot, single. And away Siddiqui. Got a bit full and straight to him. And he said, I'll have a bit of that. And plonked him over square leg for six. So Sun Bears, what have they got for us here? Ooh, short ball. That's going to be another four. Half track, you'd call that. Uh, always difficult is just leg spinner. Fingers just get a bit tense around the ball. You get 
over pitching a hit for a six and then it's always going to be well not always but higher chances of a drag down the next ball as you look to adjust your length everything just tenses up a little under pressure here four aways So I'm a roof, 11 off four now. Nicely worked away. Shazan coming off the backward point boundary. And they come back for two. That's better. Nice delivery. Well done out there by Shazan. Keeps it to one. So last ball of 14th. And nicely bowled again. Nice from Siddiqui. Nice way to finish off the over. Two singles after the six and the four. Always good to just consolidate and uh, double down, get whacked for a few more. So now it's going to be Zalik. Got the number zero on his back. Silly. Muhammad. He's a little bit expensive in his first two overs. Went for 17. It looks like a little edge on that. Maybe didn't quite carry to given his run. So drop catch there by Chuvi. Apparently, if he caught it, be interesting to see what decision the umpire gave. That's crunched again off the tee. Oh, nice though by Teresh. Just gets around and keeps it to one. Fantastic fielding. Oh, that's high. Going back, Tertia settles, and it's going to go over the top for six. Another one onto the grass bank here. Over the fence. So, Akash. Now he gets it on the act. He's eight off three. Oh, and there's that funkiness we talked about. Just ramps it. And I'll come back for two. To, oh, turn the third down. So 10 off four now for Akash. Last ball of this 15th over. That's high, and this could be caught. Don't think the field is going to get there, though. And it just plugs and spun. Tertius just ran past it. And goes for four. So, edge for another over. Excuse me. 185 for no wicket after 15.
So pressure on here. 185 for Nord after 15. Free license here for Dakar Warriors. They've got three men retired. Two other batsmen at the crease. Both strike yet over 200 strike rate. Oh, a rare dot ball. That's what we want to see. So a bit of pressure here on the Sun Bears. Oh, this one's cleaved out to the car corner. That's going to be another boundary. So it's raining fours and sixes here. And thankfully not raining water. Because no one wants that. So another dot ball, so good this. Two dot balls in the over. Oh, that's it, that's uh, length, that's slot. If this was the professional T20 leagues, that one would be in the slot area. And tucked into by Maruf Ahmed, who clobbers at for six. Anything that allows him to just free his hands and get underneath, he's going to hook into. A little bit deflating here for the Sun Bears. It's under a bit of kosh. So that's one slapped out to mid wicket hard again, but it'll just be one. Coming back for two. Ooh, and the well run. It's actually not the worst over there. It's gone dot six, dot six, two. Just the two sixes, but the other three balls were superb. So four overs left here, 197 for no wicket. Current rate, they're projecting, they'll get up around 246. We had uh, Shanian saying they're aiming for 250 before, so 246 would be around there. On our graphic we've got here, for projected rates it only goes up at six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So if they get any of those, they won't be happy. <laughs> the leg spin. Oh, it's top edge. Could be out. Chazan coming around. Oh, just goes over his head. So another six. I thought we were going to see something spectacular there from Chazan. One hand over the rope, flick it back over his head and catch it. There's just a yard too far. So good this, I like this change up. They're hitting everyone, so get the spinner on, see if you can bag a wicket. The leg spins, hard to hit, Oh, Oh, the great effort again. Some superb efforts on the boundary here, but it's gone away for six. So 6-6 six, six here to start the over. And Akash, he's flying. 26 off 7. Goes again. It's another 6 down. Could be on our head. Oh, just to the left of the commentary canopy tent pavilion. He's got a fan, so it's pretty fancy. So 18 off this over so far. Three deliveries. I like the pace off here, but it's just been a bit short. Just allow him to sit back and get underneath. Seems to toss it up here. 
Oh, now that's down the leg. So a little bit loose. The, le the leg spin was good. The uh, process and results aren't always equal. That's better. Oh, and the, the non strikers helped out the Sun Bears there. He's nearly caught his own mate out. So good dot ball. Oh, and that's a no -y. That's going to be a no ball. Pitched off the strip, but you know what? He gets away with it. Gets a three, and the next first ball of the next over, just to thank his mate, is going to be a free hit. So Shazan Shams is now going to have to bowl a free hit against him. Uh, umpire's just confirmed, but it's, uh, it's a free hit. So smart thinking there by Usman, just takes the three and lets Shazam have the free hit now. <laughs> so now it's a free hit. So Maruf Ahmed is 27 off 12, free hit time. Shazam Shams is going for 29 off his... He's bowling off spin now. And you know what? That's pretty decent. Low full toss outside off. Maruf always going to be looking leg side. And he comes back for two. So three overs left here. Well, two overs, four balls. Dakar Warriors are making a bit of a statement here. But some bears still. It's ch anything's chaseable. Oh, it's good bowling by Shazan. How old is Shazan? 40s. Yeah, so, using all of his experience here, he's got the cap on backwards. His, his teammates are calling him Daddy Cool before. So that's a wide. So... A little bit of rain this morning, but it's turned into a nice day here in Kuala Lumpur. Bit of cloud cover, just keeping that oppressive heat away. But warm on the field, and there's definitely a bit of heat being put on the ball. Dakar Warriors have been hitting it very cleanly. This one's out. This one's going to be another six, I reckon. Thankfully, just falls inside the fence. But quite a few sixes in this innings. 17 sixes so far in the innings. 17 sixes, only the nine fours. So some great hitting by Dakar Warriors. Final ball of 18th over here. Oh, and that's going to be a no ball, I reckon. Hasn't been called, but it's another six anyway. About 18 sixes so far in the innings. That's one and over. Two, three, five for no wicket after 18 here. So some bears will be happy to keep this 250 or under. And anything's chaseable. Got some big hitters for the some bears. going to go as well that's the biggest of the day i reckon that's been dispatched and that's another new ball luckily we brought some spares as hib we've currently got a few dotted around the place i think there's one 
down in the lower field. There's one or two in the jungle. There's one on the grass verge of other motorway. Oh, this could be good again. Prepare another spare. It's going to fall. Oh, it just goes. Some strikingness by Maruf Ahmed. 26s in the innings. That's just under 50% of the current score. Oh, this one is not going to be six. Just a single. So, two balls left, 19th over. And a cheeky little ramp shot again from Akash. Usman Javed after it. Putting the big ones in. They're going to come back for three. Nice work there by Uzi. The fit man. And another 50. So 51 off 14 for Akash. One, four, six sixes. 40 runs in boundaries. And that's the 250 up for the Dakar Warriors. Maruf Ahmed, 44 off 19. Short ball, oh, top edge. Just beats Chavassan and goes away for four. So final over the innings. What can Captain Tertius do for us here? Surely there's got to be a wicket on offer here. I'm predicting absolute scream of a catch taken down here by Usman. Jumping over the boundary rope. Maybe flicking it up to Shazan. Or up for himself. Is that one's carved out to a point boundary just be one though big Hendrick out there comes around oh that's probably going to be four that one right in the gap So we could be staring at some kind of LMS record here. 550s in the innings, what do you think? It's got to be up there. There can't have been a team that's gotten 650s in the innings, can there? That means you've scored over 300 and something. So it's got to be equal record potentially. If you're watching in, let us know. Have you ever seen 650s in an innings? I would think it's unlikely, but I am sometimes wrong. You can see a budding young cricketer coming past us here. So 
Three balls left. Walid Chowdhury on strike. The number seven. Sharful Islam Shaykot there, disappointingly, with a strike rate of a hundred only. Oh, yes, that's what we like to see, a dot ball. So, last ball. And you have to say, Hasib, that this Dakar Warriors innings has really fallen apart in the back end here. The last two batsmen striking at 100 or under. So, they'll be... I'm sure Shani will give them a strong talking to after this. Which could be four to finish. And it is four runs. So Islam Shaykot gets his strike rate up to 166. So 265 for Nort after 20 overs is a fantastic score for the Dakar Warriors. They'll be very happy with that. Bit of work to do for the Sun Bears. They've got a few batsmen in the hutch, but be interesting to see who's got the, the ball striking ability because they're going to have to go at a, a fair rate from the get-go. Going to need 13 and over from ball one. As we have a look at some of the other scores coming in. So we've got Cassowary's 21 20 for 4 after 16 against Nengi Lees. I think that's going to be the end of that innings there. So 16 over game over there. So Cassowary's 120 is probably a little bit under par, I reckon. Probably 130, maybe. Depends on the wicket, I guess. We've also got some other games taking part. Joburg, West Sydney, Santon. So fantastic to see those teams taking part. We've got the Malaysia Open in Kuala Lumpur. We've got games in South Africa and Sydney still. So it's awesome to see.
So we're back here. Sun Bears making a nice start to the innings. Need a few more runs, but uh, looking handy nonetheless. Left hand has looked solid. Oh, Away Siddiqui, the left hander. And I think it's Mohamed, but we've got him down as Usman, it's the, the lefty. That's all confirmed. Left arm spinner. Oh, just where he wants it. Trying to give himself some room there to heave that to the leg side. Just missed out, but I like the intent. Staying tall on it. That should go, that's short, and being hit. Oh no, he's picked the fielder. So unfortunate, I thought he got it. Just didn't quite get out the meat of the bat. Fair chunk and just holds out in the mid-wicket boundary. Good catch out there by the fielder. So first wicket goes down for the Sun Bears. And they'll be happy to Dakar Warriors. Oh, first ball, it's straight, plugs, and goes for four. So, aggressive start here from Tertius Bernard. And here come the Sun Bears. Dakar Warriors looking nervous here. Dakar Warriors looking very nervous here in the field after that show of intent from Tertius. So we've just had a text message in. They're saying bonus point victory for the Sun Bears. They think they're going to chase it inside 16 overs here. I think we need to see a cash bowl some overs if we want to see that. Maybe not him then. <laughs> So Waleed Chowdhury on to bowl. He batted number seven, just a single off the only ball he faced. This one's clapped out towards point fielder coming round. Doesn't get there. So another four. Sun Bears are flying now. They need 14.7 and over. So I need a few more of those. So it's great to have them here nonetheless. Of course, just eight individual players that we've combined and turned into a team. I looked up a, a native animal of Malaysia and the sun bear is one of them. So we called them the sun bears. We're playing a strong outfit in the Dakar Warriors. 
World Champs finalists. Lost to Masagami in that World Champs final in Cape Town. And they showed the matter with the bat. Five fifties in the innings. Akash the quickest, 14 ball 50. Short ball, hit out to long off, fielder, back and he takes it inside the rope. So another wicket falls. Great catch out there. Not bad contact as well. Fielder went to come in, then had to go back, and a good catch at the end. Just rolled, nearly rolled over the boundary. So Wally Chowdhury strikes in his second over. Now we see Chivasan Govenda out to bat. So Chuvi on strike. Wally Chowdhury in his second over. Let's have a look at Wally's stats. He started very nicely here. So his first game. This is his first LMS game. So brought in just for this tournament. He's bowled quickly. I hope Chivasan's okay there. He's taken one in the helmet, just got stuck in his grill. Hopefully no cuts or blood or anything. He did well to evade the stumps there as well. He's really taking a hit wicket umpires, just checking on him, which is good to see, and he says he's okay. So a new bowler. It's the attack now. So Ashik, the new bowler, his first over, another seamer, so Animal Hawk Ashik, Tertius Bernard, five off four, the skipper, but coming at number three. Trying to do his bit here for the cause. Oh, a nice line of length there from Ashik. So another dot. So three dots to start for Ashik. So great start for him.
Tersh is struggling here a little. There we go. That's better. Just be one though. Just got to get his hands up above the ball here. A little bit of extra bounce he's struggling to cope with. Run down there to third man again, another single. Big swing there by Tersh, just eyeing up that slog sweep. Uh, run rate just not really going anywhere here for the Sun Bears. Needing 17s from here on in. It's going to be difficult. Ooh, inside edge onto the pad. Thankfully, just falls safely. So six overs gone here. 23 for 2. Left arm spinning out. This one. Oh. So Tersh is just a little slow to get going there. Not much backing up, but uh, underway eventually. So we're all in preparation here for our final game of the day. Just PLS up against the stadium. It'll be a great encounter, I feel. PLS from Perth against the stadium, who were the winners of the karaoke. Is this one straight up? Keeper looking for it. All oh, he's held it. Great catch in the end. He did a 360, maybe a 540 there. Going around in circles there and eventually holds on. Went very high, straight up. That's the end of Tertius.
So another wicket falls. The new batsman here. Looks like it's Usman. Yeah. The left-hander. I opened the batting with him in Barbados a few months back. Very great to see him out here on another tour, enjoying his time. He's got his, his partner with him as well, lovely lady. So from Islamabad, I believe. So we see the, the PLS, the doctors, just coming in via helicopter away to our left here. So Usman on strike and Maruf Ahmed, the left arm spinner, he hit a long ball when he batted as well, a quick fire 50, 21 balls, he's a one for one off three deliveries, so nice start to his spell, he'll be eyeing up that man of the match trophy, solid gold. Solid back defence there by Aman Ula, by sorry by Usman and Aman Ula does the cleaning up. It's a great start to Maruf's spell, and he closes it out. So the arm ball high off the bat, and just pushed into the covers. Another dot ball, so. Great first over. Scoring's just really slowed now for the Sun Bears. They need 242 runs from the 65 remaining deliveries at a run rate of 18.62. So a bit of work to be done. So Saad Ibna. The skipper back into or into the attack, just getting his field right. I think he's a right arm off spinner, or finger spinner. Short ball. Uh, that he had his glasses on. That's why I couldn't see where he's pitching it, and he's gone short. <laughs> so he's given it to the umpire now. So I expect this one's he right on the money. Yep, not bad. So what's that mean? Do we think he's short-sided then if he pitched it halfway down? Short-sided or long-sided? Just a bit short and flayed away. Oh, over the head of the man at the deep gully. Akash would have caught that one, but this fielder over his head for four. So... Another boundary to the Sun Bears. Every batsman so far, except for the new man, has hit a four. Just the one, though. One each, sharing it around. Oh, and this is going to the fielder. Oh, just dropped short. He was interested out there. So, eighth over. 29 for three. Left hander, so Akash just goes into a back of point. Got a deep cover, long off. Deep square and a deep backward square. So mid wickets open here, the slog sweeps on. Plenty of space if he wants to heave it there. But he just pushes forward and dabs this one out to point. So another over, 30 for nought, 30 for three, sorry, after eight. So some work to be done here. Akar Warriors just hustling through the overs. Went for the seamers early, but now taking the pace off.
Ooh. Chubby looking to take that one square. You've seen this gap here to the leg side. Got the Kasha deep backwards square. Got the straight just kind of mid wicket. Big gap here on the leg side. Ooh. And the cut shot. So Maruf bowling nicely here. Just going for the two runs so far. Picked up the wicket. The crowd wants a cash to have a bowl here. He can't be out LBW if he's hit the ball. And it's a single. to the leg side it could be two in and out nope I think that's a good call I think that's a good call And a subfielder coming on here. Got a slight injury, supposedly, to someone. Well, that's six hitting. There's a new bowler here. Saad, gone for his second over. So the six bowlers used so far for Dakar Warriors. 33 for three. This is the tenth now. That one's clipped away to the leg side. Another single. Shot by Chuvi, clapped out to point, nice and tall. Short ball, down the leg side though, and cold wide. So free runs, some bears will love that. Ooh. So Muller bowling nicely here. got the 112 one, on his back we'll try and find out why he's got that one plus one equals two or something a bit deeper than that oh probably good Muller is a bit quicker than Chuvi out the blocks there he keeps it to a dot so some fantastic economies here as you look at the Dakar Warriors scorecard no one is going for more than a runner ball. The most expensive bowler, A.B. Jibon. One for five off one over. So fantastic disciplined bowling. Not many wide as well. Can recall one or two. So you swap ends now. The sun just seems to be breaking through for one of the first times today. Is that A.B. Jibon? Just talking about him. He's back. He's hit out towards Long On. Fielder doesn't get there, though. 
Just to the one hop to him. Wide ball. Oh, high to the leg side. Fielder circles round it. Oh, and he's taken it. He's carried it over the rope. Taxi. Taxied it across the line for six. So a great shot there by Chuvi. First six of the innings for the Sun Bears. Just went with it. It was tossed up a little. AB looking cool with the Oakleys on. And this is now what we all wanted, a cash on to bowl. The crowd's been asking for it. Our Twitter's been blowing up. So the seventh bowler, Akash, starts with a single against him. Just getting the field in the leg side right. I think Chavasson will be looking to clap this one to the leg side again. Oh, and that's teed up. Akash going back. He's not going to get there. He doesn't get there. I've seen him take those before, running backwards. He 
made good ground, but the ball's just always going away from him. So the point comes in now for the left hander. Kash is I'm not sure what he's bowling here. I think he called that the extra slow bowling. I think he's saying if you want to hit me, go for it. Travassen here. Oh <laughs> And it's been given, I think, caught behind. I think inside edge onto his pad. Good catch by the keeper. And Chavassin on his way. And Akash gets his first wicket. One for three. Now we see... Shazan to the crease. Shazan Sams. As Usman, his lovely partner, runs some water out for him. That's also great to see, isn't it? My wife has never run water onto the field for me during a cricket game. Don't get much sympathy for playing cricket all Saturday. So 216 more runs required here in the 12th over. Akash lobs it up again. Uh, so good flight and goal from Akash. He's trying to gift wrap a present there for Shazan. Maybe he wants to transfer across to Commonwealth CC for next season. Shazan said no thank you and just blocked it back down the wicket. This one's flicked away. Fine. Going to be another single. Shakib Al Akash. So seven more overs to go here. That's a nice little paddle sweep there. Don't think it's going to go for four. They're going to have to run them. So the bowler ended up fielding that down at a uh, fine leg. <laughs> really trying to look after his economy. He's That's got to be 100, 100 meters down there, do you reckon? Close. He somehow managed to beat the man who was at long leg. Oh. It's gone over the top of middle, I reckon, that one. So, AB Jibon is nicely here. Got a 50 with the bat. One for 17 with the ball. Only bowls we hit for a six, though. That's a good delivery there. So final ball of his third over.
big swing again. No contact. And the end of another over. Seven overs left here. So hopefully the final two teams are arriving. I can see the stadium up there in pink. So PLS must be close. Well, they've hopefully they all came together on the bus. So Kash on for his second over. Single. So we'll hopefully quickly get into this final game of the day. Nice shot there. Nice straight back. Punched out to mid on. Akash has been told to go back to the extra slow here. Trying to get it above the sight screen. There it is. It sits up and it's... Oh! Could be over... Th oh, no. Enough of a glove on it to just check it. Shazan thought about 16 different places to hit that. Then ended up nearly picking up backward point. And again, tossed up. Swept. Not hard, though. It's going to be at least two. Settle for two. Casual two. Could be three. Oh, good backing up. Good awareness there from AB. Nice shot there by Shazan. I think he's been practicing that in the nets this week. Nice sweep. And another over down. Oh, and SEQ Cassowaries. About to take down the New Zealand national champs, Nangi Lees. Nengi Lee's down to the last man standing with three overs left. They need 42. And they've swapped keeper there. Aman Ul Aman's just gone out to deep mid, mid wicket. Akash is taking the gloves. And Maruf Ahmed on for his third over. <laughs> 